my three packs of Time Spiral Remastered Sliver, attack your two packs of Stuffy Doll, and do nine damage because they've all got plus one one on them for each other. So you lose, I win, big money, it's Pat the Popper playing around, trying to get some big money out of these little packs. We're getting right into the first Time Spell Remastered booster pack we got. Bust through some commons real quick. See what we get for our first uncommon. It's going to be Outrider Encore, followed by Shaper Parasite and Scrib Ranger. For our rare out of the first pack, it's going to be a Draining Welk and a Retro Frame for Blood Braid Elf with Cascade on it. Not too bad as a four cost and haste. Pretty decent, pretty decent. Already messed up on the uncommons on top here. There you go. Now let's get into our next pack. Ooh, sliver pack. This has gotta be big money. They've never done me wrong. So I ordered some cards off a TCG player. So uh, looking to get my modern deck into rotation. I'm actually gonna be going down tonight. This is being recorded on a Friday. Oh, in green? That's weird. That's uh, going off to the side. So I'm actually going down tonight to do a draft experience at our local gaming store. We're going to be drafting some Ikoria. Now, since I've opened up so much Ikoria, I've got a pretty good idea when I open a pack what we're gonna be getting into. You know, I, I know which ones I want to be able to build with. Got a good idea what I want to go in. I want to be uh, want to be happier getting cards out of this slot. So far, a little disappointed for today's opening here. We've got a legendary creature, a Safri Eric's daughter, a retro frame Temir Battle Rage, ferocious. That creature also gains trample until end of turn if you control a creature with power four or greater. Not too bad. Stick that right in the pile. Still have not gotten our foil retro frame. I hope that's about to change. This might be the pack. You know, I, I worry that this is gonna be one of the boxes that has no foil retro in it. I've seen a couple of box openings online. I just hope this isn't going to be one of those. Get through these commons pretty quick. There's no big value cards in here. There are some quite utilitarian cards. Oh, I'm going to have to get that on my first tee. Stick around for merchandise. Hit like and subscribe. Then you'll be notified when I finally get there. Our rare for the pack is going to be Joyra of the Gitu. Hmm... Legendary creature, human wizard, two exile on a non land card from your hand, put four time counters on an exile card. If it doesn't have suspend, it gains suspend. So just a screw with people. Eh, seems like it's going to be low powered. Master of the Pearl Trident. Now, this is, I think, the professor's favorite card. Should send this one off to him. Got it in a retro frame, it's not our foil. But it is a pretty solid merfolk card, so it might be lauded. See what that's going to be. Stick around to the end card to find out the value. We've got the Stuffy Doll Packs. Maybe these are the ones. Have I been playing Slivers and doing it all wrong? Oh, shit, man. This might be the one. Every pack might be the one. It's like I was just talking with my cousin there. Every, uh, every pack's like playing the lottery. We'll get right past the uh, commons here into our first Celestial Crusader, Arc Blade, Rift Mark Knight. Our rare is going to be the Flagstones of Troikair. Eh. Sigils of Empty Throne. Whenever you cast an enchantment, create a 4-4 white angel creature token with flying. That seems a little jank. In a retro frame as well. A metallic sliver token. Not the one I want. I want the regular token. Uh, you know, if I'm playing a deck, I want to have the correct token cards. I don't want to have to, you know, keep using a handful of dice the whole time. 
You know, it makes me seem like a poor person. Our first card's gonna be a 4C. Can you foresee the weird artwork on that? Quite the optical illusion, isn't it? Woo 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 woo. Okay, back to it. I'm pulling out these Terramorphic, Terramorphic Expanse cards because it's just like Evolving Wilds, except you can have four of these and four Evolving Wilds. So, uh, useful. Our first uncommon out of this pack, Sudden Shock, Muck Drub, Stormcloud Gin. Our rare is going to be a Coalition Relic. Pretty solid artifact, so it's hard to deal with these ones. And a Bujoka Bog. I actually think this is a pretty solid hit. And in this old frame, pretty decent. People like these ones. A foil card thrown in here for us. A Crook Claw Transmuter. Now this is not the retro frame. We're still hunting. Stay tuned for the next couple of videos. See if we get it there. And a Sap Whirling Creature Token. So, this has been Pat the Popper. Love you. Be well.